From the team you can trust, this is breaking news from News 8. Breaking news in our Sunrise Smart Start on this Friday. Police investigating multiple shootings that sent three to the hospital overnight in Rochester. Carmela Boykin live at the Public Safety Building with more on this. Carmela, good morning. Good morning, Mark. Two victims are in the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries after they were shot inside their home from someone outside their home. Police responded to the scene at 10.13 p.m. last night on Derringer Place. A 40-year-old man and 30-year-old woman were both shot at least one time. They were both taken to Strong Memorial Hospital, where, again, they're currently being treated for non-life-threatening injuries. This is, of course, an ongoing investigation, and police ask anyone with additional information to die. 911. In Rochester, Carmela Boykin, News 8. Mark. Carmela, thank you. Rochester police also investigating a shooting on Selai Terrace that sent a man to the hospital. They responded to that area near Driving Park Avenue just after midnight. We're told a man in his 30s was shot in the upper body and taken to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. If you have any information about these shootings, again, please call 911. Police investigating a stabbing as well. Officers responded to McGee Avenue in the city around 11 o'clock. They found a 39-year-old man with a stab wound to the upper body. They say this happened on Electric Avenue. The victim was taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Well, in Washington, after months of contentious